are you? You know who I am. I do. Your friendly neighborhood Spider-Man. I'm very excited. I'm very, very excited. I'm a little nervous for the first day, but, but I'm ready to go. Toby reportedly beat out Freddie Prince Jr., Jude Law, and James Franco for the role. We have a great script to go from. We have great actors. Like a then 18-year-old Kirsten Dunst as Mary Jane. He's Spider-Man's, you know, love of his life. How cool is that? Toby and Kirsten's undeniable on-camera chemistry led to historic scenes like this. Turns out the makeout wasn't as magical behind the scenes. The conditions weren't as sexy and sweet and romantic as it came off. Rain was pouring up my nose and then she was kissing me and I couldn't breathe out of my mouth and I had to hold my breath while I was kissing her and I would sneak little breaths out of the corner of my mouth. It was like he was giving me CPR or something like that. You are amazing. I don't recommend kissing that way. <laughs> And especially in the pouring rain when you're freezing at like 5 a.m., you're not in a kissy mood. Still, it was nice kissing her. I managed to sneak some pleasure out of it. Maybe that's because the two had a real-life romance brewing offset. Toby and Kirsten started dating in 2001 while filming, but by the time the movie came out, it was a different story. I swear to God, we're just friends. <laughs> well, see ya. Now, the wet kiss wasn't the only difficulty Toby faced in that spandex spidey suit. I would get uncomfortable sometimes in that, you know, it was a little bit of a process getting out of it. So if I got a little thirsty, you know, I would, uh, it would take me a little while to get out of it because the zippers would break and they would sew me into the suit. The body hugging red and blue number was custom made for Toby using body cast and computer scans. You stand there for hours while they do different sections of your body and they peel it off you and rip lots of hair out of your body and it's excruciatingly painful. Now get this, ironically, Toby is claustrophobic, but he never let that get in the way of his superhero duties. He even did some stunts. I'm not big into spins or loops, but drops I'm okay with. Is that you? And even Kirsten got in on the action. I'd be in a harness and they'd bring me to the top and drop me down and they do a countdown too. They're like, one, two, three, and you know you're gonna drop, like, and it gives you a rush every time. As for what gave Toby his rush. I did have moments when I was walking to the set or uh, on the sound stage that it was kind of strange and surreal or somebody would just do a double take and go, oh, Spider-Man over there, hey, what's up, Spider-Man? 